We've had a number of viewer questions on how frost forms in the atmosphere. So I thought I'd take the opportunity today to show you how that process takes place. Frost is relatively simple. What we have is moisture in the atmosphere, and that moisture is in the form of water vapor. That's the gaseous form of water. And when that water vapor contacts a surface that is below 32 degrees, like the ground on a nice clear cold day, it develops millions of tiny ice crystals, a beautiful blanket of white across that surface. But there is a special type of frost that we refer to, and that frost is called hoarfrost, H-O-A-R. That frost occurs when there's much more moisture in the air. That moisture will contact these surfaces that are below 32 degrees, and you end up with an intricate array of ice crystals. These ice crystals can take on lots of different shapes. Now, hoarfrost is not that uncommon. Anywhere that you have a good moisture source, like a pond or a creek or a stream, and you have a clear, cold morning with those surface temperatures below 32 degrees, you can get these beautiful ice crystals develop. The term hoarfrost comes from the old English term hoar, H-O-I-A-R, which refers to old gray and white. And that is the explanation of frost.